In the hushed confines of the control room, Commander Elena Vega's eyes were locked onto an antiquated reel-to-reel -reel tape player. The room was thick with the scent of time and forgotten stories. The tapes bearing the mark Apollo 13 Deep Space Recordings had resurfaced after years of obscurity. The mission was destined for disaster, a malfunction in the navigation system catapulted them off course, far beyond the orbit of the moon. Memories of the panic, the crew's voices crackling with fear, lost contact with Houston, and lost hope flooded back to Elena as she pressed play. The tape hissed to life, then, a whisper. It wasn't English, nor any language she recognized. It was cosmic, like starlight transformed into sound. Elena's skin tingled, her eyes meeting those of Dr. Patel, the linguist whose life's work was understanding ancient scripts. Her eyes widened. It's not a language, Dr. Patel said, her voice barely above a whisper. It's a lament, a plea. As the recording played on, a symphony of sorrow filled the room. The voices of the astronauts intertwined with this celestial dirge, speaking of lost constellations, forgotten memories, and a longing that spanned eons. Elena's heart tightened, the memory of losing her daughter to cancer the same year Apollo 13 disappeared, resurfaced. The tape continued to play, and Elena saw something, a shadow in the corner of the room. She turned but nothing was there, still the whispers grew louder, more insistent. The faces of the astronauts appeared on the old monitor, hollow-eyed, spectral. We're not alone, their voices overlapped. They watch us, they weep. As Elena replayed the tape, the room seemed to expand, its walls dissolving into stardust. She felt weightless, unmoored. The astronauts reached out, their fingers barely brushing hers. They were here, in this in-between space, lost souls, echoes of the cosmos. Dr. Patel touched Elena's shoulder, her words chilling. They're trying to warn us. The universe mourns its lost children. Elena closed her eyes. She would never see Earth again. But perhaps that was the point. Maybe they were meant to drift. Beyond time, beyond sorrow. As the tape looped, their voices faded into the cosmos. And as Elena surrendered to the cosmic lament, she wondered, were they ghosts or guardians? Did they weep for humanity or for themselves? In the profound silence of deep space, the lost tapes whispered secrets, haunting, eternal. If you're intrigued, don't forget to like, comment, and share this video.